Welcome to a culinary adventure like no other. In this tantalizing journey, we're about to explore the most eccentric and eyebrow-raising diets that have ever graced the world of nutrition. Get ready to be amazed, amused, and perhaps a little puzzled as we delve into eating outlandish, the top 10 most bizarre diets. From quirky fads to diets that make you question your culinary sanity, join us as we uncover the quirkiest and most unconventional eating plans ever concocted. Number 10. The Cotton Ball Diet. Ever heard of the Cotton Ball Diet? Well, it involves dipping cotton balls in juice or a smoothie and then, you guessed it, swallowing them. The idea is to feel full without consuming any calories. But really, it's more like a diet of fiberless fluff. Is it effective? No, and it's definitely not recommended for obvious reasons. Plus, you won't be doing your washing machine any favors. Swallowing cotton balls can result in gastrointestinal blockages requiring medical intervention. This diet does not provide essential nutrients, vitamins, or minerals the body needs to function properly. Over time, it can lead to nutrient deficiencies. While the diet may initially create a sensation of fullness, it does not provide the body with the nutrients it needs for sustained energy and well-being. This can lead to excessive hunger and overeating later. The cotton ball diet is a risky and harmful diet trend that should be avoided. It lacks nutritional value, poses health risks, and can lead to severe physical and mental health consequences. It's important to prioritize safe, balanced, and sustainable approaches to weight management and consult with healthcare professionals when necessary. Number 9. The Baby Food Diet. Eating like a toddler. Have you ever looked at a jar of baby food and thought, I wonder if that's the secret to weight loss? Well, some people did. The baby food diet involves replacing regular meals with, you guessed it, jars of baby food. The idea is to control portion sizes, but it's also a recipe for some major nostalgia and perhaps an odd desire to suck your thumb. The diet excludes solid food, which may lead to a longing for more substantial and satisfying meals. While there are various flavors available, some individuals may find the taste of baby food less appealing than regular adult meals. Adult nutritional needs differ significantly from those of infants. Relying on baby food may result in deficiencies in certain nutrients required for adults. The baby food diet offers portion control and convenience but may not be sustainable or provide adequate nutrition for adults. It's essential to focus on a balanced and varied diet that meets the nutritional needs of your age and lifestyle. Before embarking on any diet plan, consult with a healthcare professional for guidance on healthy weight management. Number 8. The Tapeworm Diet. Unwelcome Guests. In the How Not to Diet category, we have the Tapeworm Diet. Yes, you heard that correctly. This diet involves ingesting tapeworm eggs, which, when they hatch, live inside your intestines and consume some of the calories from your food. Sounds like a plotline from a horror movie, right? Unsurprisingly, it's not only bizarre but also highly dangerous and illegal in many places. The idea behind this diet is that the tapeworm will consume some of the calories from the host's ingested food, leading to reduced calorie absorption and weight loss. Tapeworms can migrate from the intestines to other parts of the body, including the liver, brain, and other organs. This can lead to life-threatening conditions, the tapeworm diet is extremely dangerous. It can lead to severe health complications, including malnutrition, intestinal blockages, and infections. The tapeworm diet is a highly dangerous and unhealthy approach to weight loss. It poses significant health risks, lacks any scientific basis, and is considered unethical and illegal in many regions. It is crucial to prioritize safe, evidence-based, and sustainable methods for managing one's weight and consult with healthcare professionals when necessary. Number 7. The Breatharian Diet. Air is all you need. Imagine a diet that claims you can live on air alone. That's the Breatharian Diet. Proponents believe that humans can survive without food and water, relying solely on prana, or life force, and sunlight. We're all for reducing food waste, but this one is taking it a bit too far. Please, don't try this at home or anywhere, for that matter. The Breatharian diet is one of the most extreme dietary beliefs, suggesting that humans can exist without any form of sustenance, not even water. Attempting to live without food or water is extremely hazardous and can lead to severe health complications, including malnutrition, dehydration, electrolyte imbalances, organ failure, and death. Breatharians sometimes cite photosynthesis as evidence that humans can live on air and sunlight alone. However, humans lack the necessary biological mechanisms for photosynthesis. The Breatharian diet is a highly dangerous and scientifically baseless belief system. It poses extreme health risks, 
contradicts well-established biological principles and should not be attempted. It is crucial to prioritize evidence-based, balanced, and safe approaches to nutrition and well-being and to seek professional help when needed. Number 6. The Werewolf Diet. Eating by the Moonlight. If you've ever wondered if your eating habits are affected by the phases of the moon, you might be a fan of the werewolf diet. It involves fasting during the full or new moon and eating normally during the other phases. So, if you suddenly have a craving for raw meat during a full moon, you might have transformed into a canine, or you might be on this diet. The diet claims that fasting during the full moon and consuming only fluids or raw foods can help your body detoxify and shed excess weight. There is no scientific evidence to support the idea that lunar phases affect human metabolism or the body's ability to detoxify. Our bodies don't have biological mechanisms that synchronize with the moon. The moon's phases have been studied for their potential influence on human behavior and mood, but the impact is still inconclusive and doesn't relate to dietary patterns. The werewolf diet is a fad diet based on the unfounded idea that lunar phases can influence human metabolism and detoxification. It lacks scientific support and may lead to nutritional deficiencies and disordered eating habits. Number 5. The Chewing Diet. Chew your food, then spit it out. Ever been told to chew your food thoroughly? Well, the chewing diet takes it to a whole new level. It encourages chewing food thoroughly but spitting it out rather than swallowing. The theory is that the act of chewing burns calories. While that may be true, it's missing the essential step of actually digesting the food to get those nutrients. Chewing breaks down food into smaller particles, which can aid in digestion and nutrient absorption. It also starts the process of digestion by mixing food with saliva. Chewing your food thoroughly can lead to a feeling of fullness and reduce the likelihood of overeating. Chewing your food well is a well-recognized and evidence-based practice for promoting better digestion and healthy eating habits. The chewing diet emphasizes the importance of thoroughly chewing your food to promote mindful eating, better digestion, and healthy portion control. While it's not a diet in the traditional sense, incorporating this practice into your daily eating habits can be a positive step toward maintaining a healthy and balanced diet. Number 4. The Ice Diet. Melt those calories away. If you think ice cubes are just for cooling your drinks, think again. The ice diet suggests that consuming ice, particularly before a meal, can help burn calories by forcing your body to warm up. But remember, while it might help with calorie burn, it's not going to do wonders for your teeth or your desire for a warm meal. The ice diet is based on the idea of cold thermogenesis, which suggests that exposing the body to cold temperatures can boost metabolism and promote weight loss. Some followers of the diet believe that drinking ice-cold water before or after meals can enhance digestion by causing the body to expend energy to warm the stomach. However, this effect is generally minor. Staying well hydrated with fluids at a comfortable temperature is more important for overall health and well-being. The ice diet is not based on solid scientific evidence and may have limited, if any, impact on calorie burning. It is crucial to focus on safe, evidence-based, and sustainable approaches to nutrition and weight management, including staying adequately hydrated with fluids at a comfortable temperature. Number 3. The Cabbage Soup Diet. Eau de Cabbage. The cabbage soup diet is infamous for its potent side effect, a pervasive cabbage aroma. It involves eating a low-calorie cabbage soup for several days. Sure, you might lose weight, but you might also lose a few friends due to your eau de cabbage perfume. Plus, it's not the most exciting diet in the world unless you really, really love cabbage. The cabbage soup diet is designed for rapid weight loss and is often used for short-term, pre-event goals. While following the cabbage soup diet, your food choices are restricted to specific items, including the cabbage soup, fruits, vegetables, and certain proteins on different days. While the diet can lead to short-term weight loss, it is not a scientifically proven or recommended approach for sustainable, long-term weight management. The cabbage soup diet is a short-term diet plan that can lead to quick weight loss but is not considered a sustainable or balanced approach to nutrition. It is essential to prioritize a well-rounded, balanced diet and regular physical activity for long-term health and weight management rather than relying on extreme and temporary diets. Number 2. The Raw Meat Diet. The raw meat diet, also known as the carnivore diet, is based on the belief that our ancient ancestors primarily consumed raw meat. Proponents argue that it's a return to our natural, carnivorous instincts. Followers of the raw meat diet typically consume only animal products, including raw beef, fish, organs, and occasionally dairy. They avoid plant-based foods entirely. While some people claim benefits such as improved mental clarity and energy on this diet, it's highly controversial in the medical and nutritional communities. 
health experts often warn of the risks of foodborne illnesses, nutrient deficiencies, and long-term health consequences. Consuming raw meat has cultural significance in various cuisines around the world. For example, dishes like steak tartare and sashimi feature uncooked meat, but these are often prepared with special care to minimize health risks. There are different variations of the raw meat diet. Some prefer the zero-carb approach, while others include a limited selection of raw fruits and vegetables to ensure a more balanced intake of nutrients. Number 1. The Sleeping Beauty Diet. Dream away the pounds. Topping our list is the Sleeping Beauty Diet. The idea? Sleep through most of your days to avoid eating. Elvis Presley was known to be a fan, but unless you're a rock and roll legend, we don't recommend it. Sleeping Beauty may have been a fairy tale, but this diet is more like a nightmare for your health. The Sleeping Beauty diet promotes the idea of spending an excessive amount of time sleeping, often up to 20 hours or more per day. The concept of losing weight by sleeping excessively lacks scientific support and is considered an extreme and unhealthy approach. Attempting to sleep for extended periods can disrupt the body's natural circadian rhythms and lead to insomnia, making it challenging to maintain a healthy sleep schedule. Spending most of one's time sleeping can lead to social isolation as it limits engagement with family, friends, and daily activities. The Sleeping Beauty Diet is a dangerous and unsupported weight loss concept that promotes excessive sleep as a means of shedding pounds. It is not a recommended approach to weight management and can lead to a range of health issues. In the wacky world of bizarre diets, we've uncovered some of the quirkiest and most unconventional approaches to weight loss. While these diets might offer a few chuckles, it's essential to remember that sustainable and healthy weight management isn't found in the extremes but in balanced, evidence-based practices. So, before you contemplate eating like a werewolf, living on air, or hibernating like Sleeping Beauty, consider subscribing to our channel, hitting the notification bell, and giving this video a thumbs up. We're here to provide you with sensible advice, humor, and a bit of dietary quirkiness. Thanks for watching, and remember, it's always best to take your dietary advice with a grain of low-sodium, organic, pink Himalayan sea salt.